Race 21, the Peter Marsh handicap chase. Grade 2 handicap. Sour cover, Darren Thompson. Other insult to injury, Joshua Sutherland. My place later days, James Shea. Smell of victory, the amount of Mainsbury. Ran and skip John Morgan, Malaka. Dream do it. Only dressed to impress, Craig Beckwith. Tickety complaining, and Capel de Romeo. Hollywood, Colvin's up at the Wisdom, Rhythmic Room and Pass, the Sour Toga, for Alex Cherry, 12 winners for the Peter Mash. On the base here, uh, 8 up for you. I'll be going, skipping over to Fast Lads for two races for you. And Ross Jumping Noodle on the Westfields National after this race. When the skip's going to make all in the Peter Marshall, leads by a couple lengths from Passive Sour Toga in second. Sour Cover in third. Then comes Corbin towards Mother Victory. Coming towards the first fence. The first of 18, and they jump in that one. And they've all got slow, or slowly towards the rivers. Took up at the complaining. Jump in the next, and John Morgan's as soon as Kip is clear of the field. Three to four, or Sour Cover in second. Then Corbin's Wall, that is passive. Sour Toga and Stable Mate Room, if you have to room, jump to this. But, oh, he's gone in front. Yeah, that had and the jockey had no chance of staying in the saddle. So, John Lennon skips and shifted his rider and asked the Sour Cover. Now in the lead, by about a half lift to add insult to injury in second. Corbin's Wall was in third and then behind his passive Sour Toga and Rhythmic Room. Jumping up well on the far side of the Smother Victory. Behind he comes uh, Malaka Dream. Gap to the last four. The prize of Kafala Romeo to be complaining. My place later days. Um, just to impress. They're swinging in then. Still well over six to one in the Peter Marsh. And Sarah so Keller on the inside of hard mm -hmm. insult to injury. In third is that uh, rhythmic room. It goes Corbin's Wall, Brent Corbin's Wall is past his Saratoga, Malaka Dream, Malaka Dream, sorry. Then can smell the victory. I place it a day together with Cafaldo Romeo Brandies. And uh, that pair, Tickety, Tackety, complaining and dressed to impress. I'll we'll jump that one safely down the walls next. This might be the ditch, it is. I'll uh, jump in it. I'll we'll jump it safely. I've had insult injury as an length lead now from Rhythmic Boom in second. Sour cover dropped back into third. The jockey decided that he didn't want to be out in front. Wheeled him back in the bit. Jump in this one. A mistake in mid division by my place later day. He's dropped back to the rear there for James Shea. Uh, had, uh, had insult injury jumps the next. Jumps it by a length and a half. Corbin's always won the mid mistake there. In second place is Rhythmic Room, room and on the outside comes Mallorca Dream. Behind these comes Sour Cover and his Sour Cover is Capoldo Romeo. Gap then to the rest, headed by Dressed to Impress, who's improved on the inside of Corbin's Room. I play later days, is there somewhere, I can't make him out. He's hidden by the dark Indian train, Capaldi complaining. They swing left handed on the far side, the back pair, I smell the victory, and passive and sour togo was in the front bunch early on, and he's now towards the rear. They swing on the far side for the final time, they just go over a mile and they call it a run, and hard insult to entry up and then lead. He's been, he's following the loose horse, which is running skip, and left us earlier from de after departing, and they jump in that one now, and they all jumped it safely. And it's hard insult to injury by a length. I mean, second place, Sour Keller is making good ground again. But he joke jumped in by Kafala Romeo, jumped through into second. But with me, the room is in fourth. Then behind his Malaka dream and dressed to impress. It's creeping closer all the time. And then could smell a victory trying to make up ground on the outside. On the far side, passive Sour Toga. Then can my place it a date to committee. Playing that one behind. And that's Corbin's wall has never recovered from that bit, that mistake. Heading over to the next fence now, and hard insult to injury leads by about a length an hour. He's always in, and that's probably the same fence. When the skip went, and now he's took out, hard insult to injury. That fence has been done the water ditch. And I'll jump that one safely, and now I'll just smell the victory has come through to pick it up. On the outside of Cofold, the Romeo in second, Sour Cover in third, 
The idea is that improving press to impress, press to impress was improved all the time. Then past this, so I told her, a little gap into my life, a dream, and my place let a day drift. Me, the room was dropping back through the field. Corbin's horse tromped past one, and that one is taking pity, complaining. They're in the straight, they got four left to jump there. There was the next one, another four flowers. And Kafada one was up on the inside, or in second place. Sal Kava, who made a mistake, the stake there was dressed to press to impress. We now dropped away down towards the next one, the third last of the ditch. And Kafada one with these by a left, trying to get WFI, then Derek Hinton up the track. In second place, Sal Kava, then smelled the victory back in third, then in fourth place, in my place later days. Trying to pick up late in the day is Malaka Dream and dressing passage trying to recover from that mistake. Come on, more face left to jump in the front three are clear. The Kafala Room will be impressed by Sour Cover and on the outside is Smell of Victory. The inside the final three long Sour Cover being joined now by the the vice smell of victory is starting to get up and it's going to go on and win you yeah, smell of victory for Liam and Lensburg. He's a left half player. He's well clear now, Sour Cover in second. Staying on late in third was uh my place later days. And then Malaka Dream for the win. So, Liam Mum wins the and smell the victory.